Hey, so it's thunderstorming out. There's like severe thunderstorm watch for the rest of the day. So we're not going to be able to, um, our plans are just basically canceled, right? So I was thinking since we're kind of like stuck inside that we could, um, I could practice my contouring on you because, you know, I've been like trying to figure out how to contour because I don't know anything about makeup. Haven't done my makeup yet today at all. So I thought I would do some contouring on you and then um, if it looks good and I did a good job I can just do my own what do you think okay cool um, I think I have like everything that we're gonna need but if I don't we'll just kind of like wing it right I think basically we have a lot of the same shades so I'm gonna put a moisturizer on your face first, okay actually I think I'm gonna do a primer just had it. Here we go. Okay, perfect. All right, and then I'm going to do this moisturizer. some brushes but I'm gonna also use a sponge sometimes because I was watching this thing where like certain areas of the face you should use a sponge so I have my sponge here and uh, I'm just gonna get started I have this palette um, that I'm gonna use it has a lot of different colors that I'm gonna need so let me just open that set that down here okay and then I have a couple foundations these contour sticks. I'm basically just using like random things that I have. Um, but I'm not gonna go buy like 12 different foundations. What the heck? Who does that? Oh my god, look at this lip gloss. This is pretty. I might use this on you at the end. I like this. It's actually a, like a really pretty shade. Anyway, I have no idea where it came from. It looks brand new. Alright, let's put on some brush to put on some primer on your face. Okay. Is like primed really well. Just like make that dry real quick. Okay. Cool. Got that done. Okay. So the videos that I watched, you start with like darker, and then we'll go back in. We'll start with like the outside, and we'll work our way like into the face. So I am going to start with the stick, and I'm gonna basically just um, go around like here on the sides, um, and this is just like the really dark parts. Okay. So just. Bear with me here. Okay. Again, just forgive me because I like really don't know what I'm doing that much. Okay. Now I'm going to or a shade lighter. And we'll use that. Okay, I think that this will work. It's like a powder. It's not a powder. 
powder, but it almost has like a powder base. All right, I'm gonna use a, a um, sponge. I'm just going to start uh, going in while working my way inward. Okay, here we go. I think that that's like, let me see here, sorry, I'm just trying to like color match your face. Mm. I need it to be pretty dark in case your skin tone. Mm, that one's better. Okay. start moving in and I'm going to go along the cheekbones. Okay, and then the top. I'm supposed to put some down here. Let's just do it. Okay. I hope this works out. I have no idea. Alright. Now I'm gonna get a smaller brush because I'm gonna start like doing some lines. Mm, an eyeshadow brush. I don't want that one. Oh, here we go. So I'm going to go um, under the cheekbone again, or just under the line we just put on. middle of the nose because this is going to make it look skinnier or something like that. I have no idea. I don't understand the science of this. Okay, this should be very interesting when we have to blend this out. Okay, now I'm going to have to go in with the lighter color. And I'm going to use the tip of the brush. from the palette. Okay. Let me look here. Get your skin tone. 
down. Second one's better for you. Okay, let me put some of that on. I don't know how I'm going to do this on myself. I feel like I'm going to mess it up so bad. I might not even do it today. I really don't feel like putting makeup on, honestly. And right under your chin. Alright, apparently this is supposed to make your face like look like super slim or something. I don't know. I'm just wondering like how natural it's gonna look at the end. Some people are really good at makeup. I'm not one of those people. Okay, this is the super, super light shade that's like lighter than your skin. So that's what we wanna use next, I think. Let me get a good brush for this. I only have to do like a little, okay, here we go. A little bit of this. Because otherwise, it's gonna like make everything too white. It's gonna cancel out all the dark pieces that we've just done. Okay, so I have to do this on like this areas, these areas of your nose, since the dark's here. We'll do this here and here. And then I have to do it right under the cheek line and then right in the middle of the forehead. Okay, and then we're gonna blend. So I'm just like dotting it. It's just weird that you're like not blending it as you go. Okay, so actually, I don't want to brush. Sorry. This will be fine. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, Lola is feeling much better. Um, we got her medicine. She actually had, like, allergies and, like, I don't know, all types of stuff going on. Like, she's just too expensive for me. I can't deal with her. Um, but no, she's doing great. You can hear her snoring again. She's loving this, um, weather. It's just so rainy out. I'm loving it, too. It's starting to get cold out. So I'm just dotting... Here. All right, and then I have to get some for the middle of your chin. Right, here we go. All right. Just apply. I have this like spongy brush I'm gonna use, and I'm gonna just apply some more dark to the outside right here so I can just like focus it on the very top. Oh my gosh, sorry, it's got powder everywhere. The heck? Okay, sorry about that. That was annoying. Okay, sorry. Anyway, back to what I was saying. Actually, I'm just going to apply this with my fingers. I think it's more concentrated that way. Let's keep your face still. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Now it's time to blend. Okay, so I have this giant brush. This is what we're going to use on you. Oh, I actually have two giant brushes. Which one do you prefer? This one is softer, but this one is bigger. Sorry. 
just trying to see which one's better. This one. <clears throat> okay. So I'm going to start with the outside and work back in since that's what we did before. Okay, here we go. that I, don't, I think would work better. I'm going to at least try to blend the cheek areas with the sponge. a little bit better. I'm not like a huge fan either way. I'm going to go back to the brush though. See if I have any paint marks like the parts that will be just blending. I'm sorry, I think this is a um, contour stick. No, it's not. Just kidding. All right, ignore me. We'll go back to blending. You know, this is my first time doing this, so. So I'm just going to put this all over your face. Okay, and I'm just going to put this on your eyelids nothing on this I'm just blending it out because I have some makeup on there and I didn't put primer I don't want you to have like a line just keep your head still Good job. Like I might risk doing this on myself, 
but um tell me what you think and if you think like anything's weird looking then i can redo it but i think it looks really good and i'm gonna try to replicate this on me so thank you for letting me try this on you i really appreciate it